I used to commute an hour every day into work. And right now my commute is much shorter. I don't even hit a stoplight. And uh, it's just such a pleasant drive. I'll give you a little piece of my happiness each morning. The leaves are about to they're about to fall though, so I wanted to capture this before they're all gone because every day I drive by and more of the leaves are on the ground. Seriously? Seriously? You are the cutest! What you doing, Caleb? I'm pushing. And I'm getting my exercise. Whoa! My turn! Okay, it's Alicia trying to get her exercise, and that's gonna be mine. Tonight we thought we would tell you another segment from our love story. Yeah, we've had a lot of fun reminiscing on the good old days before we had any other people in our family besides just us. And we, we adore love our those little people. <laughs> but it was very different. We would stay up late and then sleep in the next day. Anyway. Um, so we wanted to tell you the story of our first date. The problem is... Well, we disagree. That we, we disagree on what our first date was. We need your help. They can help us. So we have three contenders for our first date. Yeah. The first one was about two weeks after our first dance, the night that we stayed up late talking. So it was my birthday that day, and Jeremy knew that it was my birthday. And so he ran into me as I was headed to my house for lunch, and he said, Hey, what are your plans for lunch today? And I was like, I'm going to eat it at my house. I was like, you can't just eat it at your house on your birthday. We probably said it in that exact same voice. <laughs> That's so. probably how I said it. <laughs> so he said, come with me, let's go out to lunch. And he bought my lunch, and we sat and chatted. It was pretty casual, but it was fun. I mean, it was just going out to lunch on your birthday. So, All right, so that's number one. That's number one. So number two was a couple weeks later. It was one week later. Was it really? It okay. Was one week later. A week later, my family was visiting from uh, out of town, and they were going to Lagoon, which is an amusement park. And I invited Kendra to come with us. First, he invited the girl that he liked at the time, and she said no. That's a true then story. Then <laughs> he asked me, and when he asked me, he told me that he had like asked the girl that he liked, and she said no. So, would I be willing to come? <laughs> Genius moves here. <laughs> Are you paying attention? It was fun. I mean, we just had fun at the amusement park. There was a couple times where we had to sit a little bit closer together. On the drive home, Jeremy missed our exit and it made the drive home be like two hours, even though it was only like an hour-ish drive away from us. And anyway, we drove home and we really enjoyed that. And what I remember from that drive is I had been asked out on a date for the next day and it was a full day date. Mm -hmm. And I was complaining to him. I was like, oh my gosh, I'm gonna have to be with this guy for like 12 hours. And there was like a pause and he goes, well, You've been with me for like 13 hours at this point. And I was like, yeah, but that's different. And I also remember on the drive, there was like a moment of silence. It was just quiet for like three minutes. But it was really comfortable. Yeah. It didn't matter. It was, anyway. So that was our trip to Lagoon. The Day third two. contender was about three weeks after that. And at this point, we were dating. Mm -hmm. and like, like exclusively, we like were he would be my going boyfriend. out with other people. And he asked me on a date, as a boyfriend would, it was a group date, and we went out to mini golf, which was awesome. And then we had smoothies because I was on a no sugar kick, and he was so thoughtful to come up with a treat that we could have that wouldn't be sugary. 
It was fun, but I just didn't feel like that was our first date. I just remember thinking, wow, this is my first date with him and it's so natural because we're already dating. So what do you define as a date? So that'll determine, so I guess, So to me, a boy has to ask you about it beforehand. Like, will you go on this date? And then he has to pay for it. Like for my birthday one, you were just like, hey, let's go out. That's what she thought. And then for the no, one where we was. went to Lagoon, the amusement park, you freaking <laughs> told me that you'd ask somebody else and they said no. To me, Lagoon was the first date. So yeah, tell us in the comments, which one do you think was our first date? Would you consider number one, the birthday lunch? Number two, the trip to Lagoon with the family all day, drive home, it was magical. Or number three, <laughs> Number three, the one where he actually asked me out on a date and we went to mini golf and had smoothies and it was a group date. Let us know. What do you think? And it's looking right up and it's touching the sky. Oh, what a beautiful morning. Oh, what a beautiful day.